gym at the lab starts with our mentors being committed to providing a great research experience. So the mentors actually do a lot of design around the projects to really make it fit for the student, what their research goals are, what are they doing in their graduate program, and what would they like to learn or gain. We are on the stage on designing the second target station of this palatial neutron source to model that improved design. What we needed was a robotic system which would needle fabric, essentially sew the layers together. What that does is it dramatically increases the strength for a composite material. For the future of uh, all uh, STEM subjects, really very important to encourage new generations of uh, researchers see the excitement that, that we have here and to share it and uh, really light the flame. One of the draws to come to a national laboratory, I think for GEM Fellows in particular, is exposing them to a new area in which they may not have thought about for a career or even opportunities for research collaborations. This large uh, collaborative multidisciplinary research makes the national labs stand out, showing the broad opportunities that ex exist. In having a hands-on experience on the real world on top of the world facilities is something unique. What they're given is an open-ended problem, like a problem that hasn't been solved before that needs a solution. Of course, as mentors, we're here to help them, to help guide them along their way. Just brainstorming different ideas to my mentor. How can we introduce new parameters or new ideas? It enhanced my previous knowledge about robotics. It gave me the confidence to work with software. To explore a completely different area of chemistry under extremes. To work closely with scientists that are at the top of their field. To meet other gem fellows that are completely outside of your field of study. I think the community and the culture of collaboration at ORNL is one of the things that really helps us bring the gem fellows into the experience because we put a lot of emphasis on community building in addition to the leadership and career development that we offer. It's just something that I think most chemistry PhD students don't have access to. And now I feel empowered and informed to discover new phases and new chemistry in the most extreme way. <laughs> It was an incredible learning opportunity for me. It's probably one of the best experiences I've had 